Once upon a time there was a boy called William. We have to call him William, but really he has a secret identity. William is actually the Hulk. The Hulk has a brother called James. But as coincidences go, it turns out James has a secret identity too. In fact, James is Spider-Man! One day, Spider-Man asked Hulk what he wanted for his birthday. And Hulk, William, decided, after some contemplation, that he would like a ball. Not just any ball, a really big ball. James, who'd stopped being Spider-Man for a minute, wondered what he could get William Hulk. He already had so many balls, even after he'd smashed so many. In the end, James came up with an idea. Here you go, William. A ball as big as your head. William looked at the ball. It was a very big ball, and definitely as big as his head. But then, it was his birthday after all, and William thought there might be bigger balls around. So James went back to thinking. What's the biggest thing in the world? Of course, James thought. A blue whale. Will looked at the whale. It was certainly very big. Gigantic, actually. But it wasn't a ball. William tried to fit the whale under his bed, but it just wouldn't fit. So James thought again, and this time he got it. He knew the biggest, roundestest thing there was. A ball as big as the world! William liked the world ball, but how could he fit it in his room? So they decided to ask the cleverest person they knew. If anyone knew how to fit the whole world into William's room, it couldn't be no one else than Uncle Christopher. Now, Uncle Christopher had a secret identity too, but only James and William knew it, and they weren't allowed to tell anyone. William told Uncle Christopher about the problem. Uncle Christopher thought for a while, and then said, William, can you do a headstand? William tried, and he could. OK, William, said Uncle Christopher. Now look down. And William realised that what he was holding in his hands was a ball the size of the whole world. The world turned out to be quite heavy, so James and Christopher joined in to help. Which just goes to show, we've all got the world in our hands. Sometimes it's just a matter of perspective. Good night.